I'm sure that there are at least 10,000 children doing some type of caregiving. Some don't have a choice because if your single mom gets sick and you're the only one there, who else is there to help her? No child should have to drop out of school because of caregiving. As far back as I can remember, she would bathe me and put clothes on me, and now it's like me doing that for her. It was kind of hard, like after having six classes a day, and then you having homework, and then coming home, and having to help out. The skills that we teach them are ones that they can use throughout their life. A social worker goes into the home um, and sees what else might be needed to help strengthen the family. Because the more we can strengthen the family, then the lower the burden is on the child. If I ever felt frustrated, I knew not to yell or anything and just go in my room and just take a breather and then go back and then help out. And if I can't take too much, then I'll just you know, step away from it a little bit and then go back to it. We always talk about the things that's been going on and how we overcome it and if we have frustrations we talk to each other so we know that we're not alone. They really need that time to be able to get away have um, and be taken care of instead of having to take care of someone else. Help can never really hurt you, you know, it only helps, it benefits you in a good way. And it's, it's been a blessing in my life, it's been amazing.